Nick here, hope you guys are doing well. And unfortunately, it looks like the internet is in a very bad place once again. Now, I don't mean content wise. I'm sure the internet will always remain a place of amazing resources and content and just material to learn from. What I am terrified of is some policy and regulations that could take place as early as next year that could severely limit how we access the information the internet has to offer. Our new administration has overhauled several government institutions, the FCC being one of them, and its newly appointed chairman, Ajit Pai, has taken some serious steps towards dismantling certain net neutrality rules established back in 2015 under the Obama administration. Basically, if the FCC and Ajit Pai and all of your internet service providers get their way, you will no longer have on-command access to any website or online service. Your gateway to the internet will be completely limited by one, your budget, and two, the content that other ISPs have been paid to shove down your throat. It's really bad, and that means that if Xfinity and Comcast and AT&T partner with, say, Bing, and Bing pays them billions of dollars, you will never make another Google search in your life. Let's talk about it. I guess we should first start by discussing the details of net neutrality and why this has all gotten so out of hand. Essentially, the term refers to a larger list of rulings and edicts that were set up back in 2015 to prevent internet service providers from tampering with your access to the internet in any way. Now, obviously you can understand why this is a huge deal. It's your right to choose Google over Bing, Facebook over MySpace, YouTube over Vimeo and so on and so forth and vice versa as well. And the fact that some of these choices can in some way be manipulated is an inherent violation of what it means to use the internet, something that was created for the free and open exchange of information. Now thankfully laws were set up back in 2015 to prevent this kind of stuff from happening. But newly appointed FCC chairman Ajit Pai has mounted an all out crusade to dismantle all of the work that has been done. And if he gets his way, the internet and your access to it will fall under the control of only a handful of internet service providers. That means they'll be able to block some sites, throttle your speeds to others, and charge you obscene rates for whatever's left over. It's incredibly unjust and it's a huge violation of the internet's core values. And if we don't do anything about it, we are in for a huge domestic threat. This is one of those videos where I feel like a so what section is superfluous. Our only reason to fight against this is because it's profoundly wrong. We have several internet service providers that are spending billions of dollars a piece trying to prevent our access to the internet. It's mindless. And given the fact that places like Google, Reddit, Facebook, Amazon have all come to our support and rallied behind net neutrality, it speaks to one thing only, that this whole FCC rollback is just a ploy so that several internet service providers can take their almost monopolistic stranglehold on the only way we get connected and take it a step further. Internet is a utility that is almost of equivalent importance to water and electricity. And to think that they're gonna mess with the only way we can access the library of information that is spread across the world, it's so frightening. So this video goes out to my Twitter trolls and my Reddit educators and my journalists and my freelancers and my video creators and every other reason that I use the internet. I think it's the most important resource in the world because the knowledge derived from this medium, I honestly think makes the world largely a better place. So please do your part to protect it. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for making it this far. Click my links down below to read my Huffington Post articles and follow me on social media when you can. Thanks, guys.